about everybody wants to improve their Wi-Fi signal at home, and there's a lot of great solutions out there to do that. And I have Oleg from Netgear to talk about that. Thanks for joining us. Absolutely, great to be here. So Oleg, I guess the first thing is you want a good router, but not everybody can put the router in like a, a central area in the home. What other kind of solutions do you guys offer? Yeah, a lot of people actually have their, uh, their router in the basement or in their garage or whatever, and we have a couple different solutions for those people that want to bring Wi-Fi into their whole home. First, we have extenders, and today we're announcing a brand new extender or this week we're announcing a brand new extender called the EX7300. And I like to walk people, just to show how impressive this is, I like to walk people through a little bit of our history. So just a couple years ago, we announced this R7000 flagship router, which is 3x3 plus 3x3 AC1900. And it was roughly this size, which at the time was pretty big. Then we shrunk it down to this product right here, the EX7000 last year, which is also 3x3 plus 3x3. And now we took all that technology, added two more antennas to make this 4x4 plus 3x3, AC2200, and added Wave 2 Wi-Fi, which is MU MIMO, beam forming, and our fast lane technology. And now it's this big. So it's an amazing feat, I think. It is. And like, how, how do range extenders really work? Because I understand that, you know, you say you have a dead spot. Say it's your, your backyard. Um, you have to put it 50% from where your router is to the area that you want coverage on, correct? Absolutely, and you're one of the very few people that knows that because usually what people do is they say, hey, my Wi-Fi doesn't work here, I better plug the range extender in right here. Well, now they're repeating no signal. So what they need to do is they need to go somewhere in between, and for that purpose, we have these, these uh, helpful little lights. So they plug them into each uh, outlet where they think is roughly in between, and it will tell them if they need to move either further away from the router or closer to the router. How do, how do range extenders like actually work? Is it just like taking a Wi-Fi signal and amplifying it? Actually, yes, that's exactly what it is. So the product acts like a client, connects to the router as if it's any other client, and then it creates a new hotspot based on that signal that it create, that it uh, is connected to. Now, oh, look, one of my favorite pieces of tech accessories, and a lot of people don't know about it, is uh, power line adapters. It's like the best thing ever. Oh, thank you so much for appreciating it because it's my favorite thing ever too. <laughs> and so how do power lines work? So power line is actually a really simple technology. I mean, without getting into like the physics of it, but all you really have to do is you plug one end into your router, plug it into the wall, and then every single outlet in the house lights up and you could plug in the other half of the adapter or up to eight other adapters throughout your house just create either an ethernet connection or a new Wi-Fi hotspot. So the cool thing about power line adapters is it uses the electrical grid in your house. Exactly to right. base, So it's kind of like having a super long ethernet cord from one end to the other, but it's using the copper wiring that's built in all, every house. That's exactly right. Some people even call it ethernet replacement. And one thing I really like is that, you know, the thing about power lines, you have to plug it in the wall, but you guys actually still allow an outlet to, to plug other devices into the power line as well. That's right, but one of the technologies that we, uh, that we announced last year, the PL1200, has an actual pass-through port, so you don't plug up the plug. So, what kind of price points are we talking if you want to get a range extender or a power line adapter? This is great, actually, uh, let's walk through the whole, the whole range. So, we are announcing the PL1000 uh, at this, this year's CES, which is gigabit power line, that's going to be $69.99. Last year, we announced the PL1200 and the PLP1200, which is 1.2 gigabit with pass-through and without, um, which is $79.99 and then $89.99. And then we just also announced the Wi-Fi version of the power line, which is gigabit power line with 11 AC Wi-Fi for $119.99. And then the extender that I just talked to you about is $169.99. And then we have also the little brother of that one, which is AC1900 for $139.99. So if you're looking to improve your Wi-Fi signal in the home, step one, make sure you have a good router, preferably a Netgear router. And step two, you could also look at range extenders and power line adapters to basically get that Wi-Fi signal everywhere in your home. Oleg, thanks so much. Absolutely, thank you.